Welcome. So what a great utopia we have made for ourselves on this uh, planet Earth. Ah, it's so good now. You know, I mean, people nowadays are so materialistic, aren't they? Right? I mean, it's not who they are. It's not what family they came from. It's what materialistic things they have. That's why they all have these iPhones or phones, you know, like the up upgrades. They've got to have the upgrades. They've got to have the, the recent phone because that's who they are now, right? You take away their phones. You take away their the car that they can't really afford, but it's, you know, it's the newest one, newest model. You take all that stuff away from them. And who is left? There's nobody left. There's no personality. There's nobody there. Right? And it didn't always used to be like that. You know, years ago, it was people had, you know, honor, respect. And it did count what family you came from. And material things were all right, but they were not overly emphasized. You know, you needed enough to survive, of course. Um, but yeah, it wasn't, well, basically we, you know, time gone by, <clears throat> people had class, they had depth, right? And it's, it's, it's really not that way anymore. And it, it's a shame, you know, and I, I've noticed uh, it uh, to be like that. And it, it's, a, it's a terrible shame. But women are, women are, I've, I've always been materialistic, right? Um, not, not to this extent. And I'm not talking that men aren't materialistic too. Now the young men are. But um, women have always been materialistic. Even going back, you know, they, they always were. But not as bad. And there is a reason you think that this might be the case. This, this might be a, a, a positive for um for society in a way because if you think about it we're in the caves or whatever and we're in the caves sort of thing and and the woman sort of says to the man you know two caves down Huckleberry's got a, a new bow he's made a new bow and it shoots arrows further and faster how come you haven't got one and that might make the man think you know hang about what do you mean he's got a new bow what's that oh I better go check that out so you can understand why that might play, you know, be in the play there, might might work, right? So women being materialistic is probably, that's probably how it started, I would think. Um, but they, they have become to the point now where they're very materialistic and very, very shallow people, right? Like I say, you take all their materialistic stuff away from them and there is nothing much left anymore. And young young uh, people in general are, are like that. And, and that is a terrible shame. Not all countries are like that, by the way. You know, some countries are trying to stave that, you know, keep it away, uh, keep the Western type thing away. Um, so good luck to them on, on that one. I mean, it must be easier for them now to see how, what a mess the um, European areas and the um, Western areas are now. And to, to be able to say that's not the way to go. All right. Anyway, that's just my, um, my little take on that. Um, and uh, you young people out there are probably going, oh, what an old fogey. Cool, he don't know anything, does he? I bet he hasn't even got the newest iPhone on him. You're right. I don't. I've got a phone that I have, which is a no-name brand sort of thing. And it, it does do texts, it does do pictures and everything else. And the only reason I got it is because um, it's easier to text. You can see easier things, see it better, easier, you know, not, not, not those old little ones. Uh, so that's the only reason I got a touchscreen one. Um, you know, I still find it quite annoying, right? And you can't beat 
conversation, personal conversation people out there, you know what I mean? You can't beat it. That's uh, interacting with people, not texting. Anyway, ciao.